Yo, what's up guys, it's me, Paradox Gaming here with a new tutorial. In this tutorial we are going to be going over how to get the Fairy Soul Waypoint and how to download Bad Lion Client to use it. Okay, so to start off to use Fairy Soul Waypoint you will need bad lion client if you already have bad lion client skip to the timestamp in the description or on screen right now but to start let's get bad lion downloaded so to start you go to the bad lion client dot net website so yeah and then after that you go to downloads windows or mac whatever you're on after that it will download it I have already installed mine but you then open it up say yes and then it will it black screens out because it doesn't like it and then you just say I agree and then you would say install I've already installed mine and then once you've done that you need to go to your bad lion and you will you won't be logged in so I will log out and it will be like this so then you have to if you don't have an account you'll then have to register now you then select your minecraft account an email address and you confirm your email address register you it will then go on to a website a bad line website and it will there ask you for your date of birth and your password so after you've done that you go back to this and you log in so I shall just cut to once I've logged in. It's pretty simple if you don't know how to log in. What are you doing? So I'll see you guys once I've logged in. Okay, so we have now logged in. You are now on Bad Lion. So once you are in Bad Lion, if you, what you want to do is play, set it up so you don't want beta and you want to launch in Minecraft version 1.8.9. And then once we are in the game, and you have the game loading you'll wait for it to load go to multiplayer and open your multiplayer up and then I already have it installed so I shall just pretend that I don't have it installed so this is as if we don't have it installed so then what you want to do is you want to go to configure mod profiles which you'll just have the default you won't have this fairy soul one you then want to click this folder icon to open this which is your BLC client mod profiles so after you've done that you can close Minecraft down and you need to go back to this so you then need to get fairy soul waypoints and I shall link the per I shall put the name of the person in the description who made it now they don't want any socials out so it's fine and that's all good I also want to give credit to time dio because he made a video on it but it's been updated so i'm updating it for him so you then go to this website you download and it should download here sometimes it will have a pop-up website and like here you don't want to click on any of it because it could be viruses or it could be adverts and if a google chrome small page cut comes up just close it don't click on anything it might say for example your browser's at risk it's uh, if it's at risk it's at risk to the thing that you click on to fix it anyway you then open show it in folder and you have your downloads folder so you then want to get your downloads folder next to your blc profile and you see we have just downloaded the fairy soul waypoint 1.0 you then need to drag it into blc client mod profiles so i've already got it there and then what you want to do is you want to close all of your things down and then you just want to launch your blc pro blc again then once you've done that you shall have the mod profile so that's all good you can then go on to multiplayer and you are in so then what you can do is you go into mod profiles and click on fairy souls and you then shall it will probably be at the bottom here so it'll be all the way down here but it will say waypoints and then you can put a star on it to put it at the top and then you click on settings and you have all of your waypoints now when i was doing the fairy souls for next saturday's video because I did them on my Minionless profile 
you will see that half of them, for example, this one here, I'm on my second profile at the moment. Actually, no, I am on my main, but there's nothing there, so, okay, I don't have anything to get up, but there's no, half of them, that might be there, but I know, because it's deep caverns, so that's the deep caverns fairy soul, so what I would do is go through them all and check them all, which you can do when you want, but as you can see, this is all the waypoints, so the hub 36. Now, this might not be here. Now, the reason for this is some of the hub souls are incorrect. So, that's because when the hub map was updated, some of them were updated and not. And it hasn't yet been updated on the mod. So, hubs, pro, hub souls 1 through 40 are all good. Now it's 1 through 40 or 41. Once you get to Hub Soul 40, go on to Time Dio's updated Fairy Soul video. I shall also link that in the description and watch it from the Hub Soul 40 all the way to the end. And then at the end, you will still have to do the Hub Soul 1.5 and 34.5 and, th and 76.5 to get them all and apart from that all the other areas should be correct so that's what i did for mine but for example if we just for proof of concept if we go to hub so 1.5 over here we can see that there will be a fairy soul here so if i can jump over the tree roots just here we have the Hub, so, hub fairy soul down here you have to jump down somewhere I can't remember exactly but let me get my grappling hook and AOTD out then we might actually be able to find it but it is it will be here somewhere so yeah okay so it's down here I thought it was a different one and here we have the fairy soul as you can see it's next to it and you, there's a ton of them now with this, you can probably reduce the time it takes your t for you to do your fairy souls from, I don't know, about maybe two hours, two and a half hours to, I did all the ones except like end, end blazing fortress, basically all the combat areas and dungeon hub and dungeon souls. I did them all in an hour, whereas the time before on my other profile i couldn't i only it took me like two and a half hours to do most of them and half and three or four of the main hub ones are missing so that's not ideal but as you can see we have the fairy souls well i don't have them all because i'm bad but if if i go on to my minionless profile that i did a few days ago for next weekend's videos we can see that quest log fairy souls we haven't got all of them but like there's one in the park which is parkour which is next to impossible to do at the moment they've got all the all the deep cavern souls and all the gold hub i've got all the hub all the gold mine all the ones that i have been to all the mushroom desert all the barn on so i've done most of them but yeah that's about it so that is all the fairy souls. It looks like a big mess on your screen, but as I said, if you just click settings, you can deselect them all and select them all. Apart from that, that's the hub way soul point. So credit to Time Dio and the other person who made, I can't remember who made the pack, but they obviously don't want any socials from Time Dio's video. I'll also link Time Dio's original video, but there's just need some cal calc clarification with the new souls but apart from that that's it from me bye for now see ya have a good time with your fairy souls as well they're really annoying